Okay, welcome. Uh, shorter stream today, slightly. Uh, just doing day seven, and that's probably it. Uh, 2018, like middle tens uh, tasks, just so uh, resourceful. Probably do them on weekends better than work days. Like after four four hours of streaming, it's hard to get back to work. You know, nonstop coding. I hope this is easier task uh, and we do this and then we, we stop. Okay. Um, a giant whale has decided your submarine is its next meal and it's much faster than yours and over the run. So each and some tiny submarine is too deep for them otherwise. It zooms in to risk the seem to be preparing to blast the whole Okay, uh, this is, I think this is some sort of optimization tasks. If you're preparing a lead code, you should know how to solve this. I don't naturally, right? So we'll just do it uh, hardcore way, just brute force everything. Um, <laughs> print split. Pars long. This is our pars. Let's start REPL. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, so kind of let's try to find a solution, right? So it's kind of obvious that uh, our answer lies beneath between the smallest number and the highest number, right? So we just try each of them and calculate the calculate the cost oh nice closure yeah it is closure um hmm. yeah it's, uh, let's just try brute force first and see how it goes and it either works or not right so Parse input. Right now, for each position, like we try to calculate the cost. So basically, we um, hmm. so this is what we do. We try res is going to be in range. Right, so we try each position in between, like that. Uh, for each position here, we want to produce a fuel, fuel cost, right? And basically, f you get fuel cost by um, Mm. 
by uh, plus um, minus xs. This is your fuel cost, right? And this is fuel cost for each of the positions. And basically what you need to do is reduce this for minimal, right? 37, is that correct answer? It is. Let's see if we can solve 335, 330. And that's the right answer. Yay! <laughs> yeah, that's easy. It was super not optimal, but um, it worked, right? For just for a second, wait for a second, and yeah. Play the game that you need to play, not the, some imaginary games that you think for yourself, right? We get the answer, so that's what matters. The crabs don't seem interested in your proposal, which perhaps you must understand crab engineering, because generally crab submarine engine don't burn fuel at a constant rate. Instead, each change of, I'm sorry, one step in result because one more unit of fuel than the last. The first step costs one, the second step costs two, the third step costs three. I have a theory that maybe like the position that we find must be aligned with one crab, but I'm not sure if that's correct. <laughs> Sounds like a text for a t-shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, uh, it's some sports um, coach invented, I think, or something like that. No, no, yeah. It's, it's from a story from a guy who teach himself like karate or something like martial arts. Like he was very old for, for to start like 30 something or 40 maybe years old. Uh, but he decided he wanted to do to learn that. Uh, he started learning and he found like one easy trick that he could be doing and get wins so he started doing that training that and doing that and yeah he wasn't very good at anything else in this sport but he was good at this particular trick and it gets him wins so yeah that's what matters right um so what we need to change is we need to change our formula right uh, so basically the part two is kind of the same but uh, different formula. So let's make, so basically this formula is different. And um, so it's one, two, three, say, four, five. I would say it's n plus n minus one, uh, Or wait, plus or minus or multiple. Okay, so let's say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we basically need to sum um, first, it's like nine. It's like that, right? So this is our distance. And uh, we just return multiply dist dist one like that right x yeah sure 
let's see uh cost to move from 16 to 5 66 from 1 to 5 10 yeah i think i get it right um let's just return it like that let's call it cost 2 because uh, it's like One six eight is correct. And basically, it's the same because it's like the same. Mm, the same formula, just a little bit different formula. Same same amount of computation. Hey, we won it. Well, that was fast. Yeah, we just started. Ten minutes. Okay. Um, <laughs> maybe. Yeah, and minus one. Yeah, I, I also thought about that minus one. I had to go factorial, but with addition, <laughs> to eventually get there. Uh, the answer to the first one is just the mean, sorry, median. Hi, Adam. Um, let's do something in humble UI. Yeah, yeah, maybe we can do that. What? It's okay. Interesting, even though not obvious. For me, but I can. Imagine it be the case, sure. Okay. So, okay. Well, we can count the average and see if it matches the number, right? We can. Um, Have this. Okay, well, what we can do is plus. plus uh, no average what do you mean average ah you mean the it's a floor around of average okay okay so we have this average and we compute the cost yeah maybe 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 no that would make uh, everything faster for sure. Did I commit? Yeah, I can, uh, it just doesn't matter. Okay, let me stop recording.